So I really enjoyed the film. It was Thank quite you. an experience in the IMAX with the 3D, 3D glasses. That was really exciting. This kind of film, um, it's a pretty big undertaking mm. with the effects and you know battle scenes. How were you able to uh, pinpoint how you were going to shoot this film and how you wanted to tell the story? Well, I think um, what's important is we had such an amazing cast that have been involved in incredible movies. And the crew themselves have done movies like Gladiator, Black Hawk Down, Saving Private Ryan, incredible action uh, special effects movies. Mm -hmm. And so between Ray Fiennes, Liam Neeson, Sam Worthington, an incredible crew, you, as a director, you have people who are a wealth of knowledge. So if I have something in my head, I can ask these guys how they achieved it before and almost stand on their shoulders to do something, to try mm -hmm. and do something as good. Well, when you're directing and you see things that the actors don't see, because mm. obviously you're seeing it from a different perspective, how do you direct them or empower them to get what you're looking for? Well, I think you give the guys, as, the actors, as much information as possible. You show them art of what the creatures will look like, uh, things mm -hmm. like that. And then you rely on their imagination to create things that they see. And Sam is brilliant at that, probably from Avatar. But like when the labyrinth is coming apart, Sam would do all these looks to nothing that I wasn't even directing. But then when you watch, when I was watching back dailies, um, he gave the animators a lot of opportunities to put effects into the frame. Mm. And so, yeah, I think what it is is you just trust the actors you hire, you trust the crew you hire, and then when something's going a little off course, you redirect it right. to where you want it. Uh, one of the biggest things about this film is the special effects. I've seen some films, this film, they were amazing and they were very real and they were brilliantly done and it worked. But I've also Thanks. seen other films where I get pulled out and mm. it's kind of cheesy and it doesn't work. When you're making the film, how do you know that the effects you're choosing how they're going to turn out, or you, do you kind of not? You, you don't. I think the, th the theory I have is the more an effect can interact with what's on set, the more chance it has of being real. In other words, mm -hmm. if you have a camera running through a village, make sure it's running through walls, running through things you know are really there, and then you'll mm -hmm. believe more or enjoy the fact that it is in the village more. Um, you know, make sure with the Cyclops that it's pulling on Sam. Just have it interact with the world around the actor as much as possible. Mm, okay. Um, obviously, like you mentioned, a great, amazing cast. Mm. What, as a director, excites you about an actor? What qualities? I just think, for example, a, a guy like Liam, when you put a camera on him and he starts acting, you feel like you're watching a movie right away. Like you may, as a director, you forget you're directing, you just want to take out the popcorn and then you forget to call cut. Mm -hmm. But um, you know, when Rafe and Liam are on screen together, it's fantastic. When Sam is doing any action moment, it's, it's just exciting. You feel like you're watching a movie, you know, and then you go, oh, wow, this is my film. That's pretty incredible. Yeah. Um, are fantasy films or battle films kind of your favorite kind of films to direct? or I love them. I mean, there are movies I love watching, and there are movies I loved to go and watch as a kid, so it's a lot of fun, you know, because those are the movies when you start out when you're 12 years old with the camera, that's what you try and do with yeah. your little video camera, so here you're doing it uh, with incredible people. And would you say they're more challenging than doing no, non battle scene or non -battle? No, I think dramatic scenes are just as difficult because you've got to get those right so people care about the action. They're probably more important uh, than action scenes. How, I'm, I'm always curious, how closely do you as the director work with the writer on, a, on the it, set? On it a differs, it differs. You know, here we had a script that um, was sort of, we tried our best once it was done to make it as good as possible but on a, on a big film like this you have you almost have action sequences and you join them up with story and you try and make mm. sure that the story is powerful it's a different process on a movie like this yes, i see well it was a great film and i really enjoyed thank watching you. it was a great experience thanks nice to meet you